Tables Tables are the data storage facilities in MS Access. You can create a database and store data in tables. Tables include subject-based lists that contain rows and columns. For example, you can create a contacts table to store a list of names, addresses and contact numbers. Create new table in Microsoft Access 2010. Click on Create tab. Click on Table Design button. You will see the table designation windows appear. Enter field's name and its data type as set field STD ID or standard ID to primary key. Not allowing duplicate data for STD ID. By right click on that field and choose primary key. Press Ctrl plus S to save the table. If you save a new table without setting a primary key, Access prompts you to create a new field for the primary key. If you click Yes, Access creates an ID field to provide a unique value for each record. No more. A relationship is a logical connection between two tables that specifies fields that the tables have in common. How to create a structure of database in design mode? After creating a table and naming it in database, you need to define structure. Structure means field and its type. Data types in MS Access determine the kind of values that users can store in a particular field. Data types Text Stores up to 255 characters. Use for text or combination of text and number like data included address, name, etc. Memo Use for lengthy text and number such as note or description. Stores up to 65536 characters. Number Stores up to 8 bytes used for mathematical calculation, except calculation involving money or currency type. Date or time Use for date and time and stores 8 bytes. Currency Use for currency values and to prevent rounding off during calculation. Yes or no. Use for data that can be only one of two possible values, such as yes or no, true or false, stores one bit. Null values are not allowed. OLE object Used for object linking, embedding and stores up to 1 GB. Hyperlink Used for hyperlinks. A hyperlink can be unique path or URL. Stores up to 64,000 characters. Attachment Used for attaching images, files along with records. Auto number Used for sequential or random numbers that are replication ID or GUID automatically. Stores 4 bytes, stores 16 bytes. Steps to define field. Click on field option in tab. Click on view option then design view. Table which will select will be shown in design view. Below field name, type the field name like roll number, student name. Then define the appropriate data type. Description is optional. If you want, you can type or give description. Terms related to tables. All tables are composed of horizontal rows and vertical columns with small rectangles called cells in the places where rows and columns intersect. In Access, rows and columns are referred to as records and fields.
A field is a way of organizing information by type. Think of the field name as a question and every cell within that field as a response to that question. A record is one unit of information. Every cell on a given row is a part of that row's record. Each record has its own ID number. Within a table, each ID number is unique to its record and refers to all of the information within that record. The ID number for a record cannot be changed. Save a table. Steps for save a table. If you are saving the table for the first time, then you type a name for the table and then click OK. If we are saving multiple timing, then we press only Ctrl plus S. Click on the File tab. Choose Save from the drop-down menu. Give a table name. Click on OK button to save the table. No more. To save the database, press Ctrl plus S key combination or choose Save option from the Office button. To quit Microsoft Access, press Alt plus F4 key combination.